Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com, and today we're going to show you how to jailbreak an iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. Okay, so before you begin this, it's highly suggested that you check out our uh, glossary to figure out certain terms that we use uh, by clicking on this link here, or uh, and also going here to check out kind of the difference between jailbreaking and rooting, some of the benefits, why we do it, what, what it's called, uh, all that kind of stuff. Once you're done that, then you can come back to this procedure and we can continue. Okay, when it comes to jailbreaking your iOS device, you do need to know what firmware you're on because there's a different jailbreaking method for every firmware. Uh, so check your device's firmware. You can do that by going to settings, general, about, and then scrolling down and looking for firmware. It's usually listed in like a uh, number dot number dot number format. Uh, usually, like for example, at the time of writing this, it's 5.1.1. So take note of whatever that is, and then the next step is you're going to go to our iOS How To's section by clicking on this link here. And then choosing your device. And then looking for the How To Jailbreak for your device and your firmware. Click on that, follow that procedure, and when you're done, you should have the Cydia app on your iPhone or iPad or iPod Touch, and that means you're jailbroken and ready to go. Now, if you go to the iOS how-to section and look for your device and your firmware and you don't see it, please click on this link here to be taken to our uh, contact us form for suggesting how-tos, and let us know your device, whether it's iPhone, whatever, and then also the firmware that you're on uh, and we'll get to work on trying to do a how-to for that right away. Okay, and after you're jailbroken and have the Cydia app on your device, it would be wise to check out the iPhone tips and tricks section. This will show you certain things you can do with Cydia, uh, changing Siri, changing the themes, all that kind of stuff. Uh, we show you how to do that there. And then also, uh, you can go back to the iOS uh, how-to section and look for the how to unlock your iPhone. This is optional. It's only if you want to use your device on another carrier. Thank you.